Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Mimi, and today I'm sharing with you my current five favorite fragrances. I am new to the frag community here on YouTube, but I am no stranger to YouTube, so please take the time to like, comment, subscribe, and share so that you will be one of the first to know when my videos are uploaded as well as you are helping me grow. Now, let's get started. The first fragrance I would say is probably the most worn at this time because I am still home and teaching my babies as in New York we are still in within the school year at least for another two weeks and that has to be none other than Flora Botanica. Now I'm not sure what you would have thought I would reach for but for me Flora Botanica is that wusa that keep calm and mom fragrance it is what I need to start my day it's very herbally the top note is mint the but the base notes have vetiver so it's a very it is a green fragrance but it is such a vibe it's so just hmm, just it's a beautiful fragrance in the mid you have some notes of rose and cannabis and I'm not talking about like roll it up cannabis like no that would be disgusting more of the herbal sense of its natural form of cannabis but it's really really a safe first experience with green fragrances and I highly recommend it next I have one that I just received for Mother's Day from my children and my husband and this was of course after I experienced the first kiss from Layered so I'm sure if you watch perfume and fragrance hauls and videos and comparisons and just anything about the top fragrances out right now you've heard of Delina or first kiss Delina Delina exclusive well for me after my experience with first kiss I put Delina exclusive on my Mother's Day wish list and I was gifted this beautiful beautiful fragrance it's so creamy I don't think a lot of people don't talk about how powdery it gets but I think that's one of the things that I love about it that it's jammy it's sexy it's powdery but it's like unapologetic but Delina is in my opinion, it's nice, but compared to Delina Exclusive, mm -mm. no sis, you need Delina Exclusive. I really, really enjoy it, and I think you would too. If you like powdery fragrances, because it gets very powdery after a while, but it's like a like a sexy powdery. What I will tell you about me is I like fragrances that make me feel grown and sexy. And that's what I look for in my fragrances. <clears throat> Excuse me. Next, I would have to also say that it's very important for me to not be overpowering because again, I am in the house. The most exciting place that I'm going right now is the grocery store. Uh, or the only other person that has been my, around myself and my children. Um, I'm a military wife and my husband is deployed. So it's again just myself and my kids and the only person that I have been interchanging with when I need to go to the grocery store is my mother. So I wear Mon Girl On. And this is the original Eau de Parfum. And the reason why I have been loving this, I was actually watching a few um, videos about uh, fragrances before I picked up Mangalon, but it was simply Aisha, and I will link her channel down below. She also has a blog that where she does Fragrance Fridays, very, very informational, and I love that. But she said that Mangalon smells like a mom. I've seen other places where they said that Mangalon smells like a hug. And I couldn't agree with the more, the lavender, the vanilla. It's just a beautiful fragrance. I don't think there's anyone who would not like Mangalon because it is so cozy. It's not overpowering. It is 
as I've also heard another reviewer say, it's like a wife. It's pretty, it's far from basic, but she just has it together and she's taking care of business. And that's what my grandma smells like. And next, I have been really enjoying the house of Mason Francis Kirkjohn. And this was sold, I shouldn't say sold to me, but the person who really sold this to me by her reaction to this house was Sheree Lewis. Um, and she's here on YouTube as well. But the way that she talked about, first of all, the house of Mason Francis Kirk Dijon, I just went down that rabbit hole after watching Sheree's videos, but also because starting with Baccarat Rouge and then trying the samples of the other fragrances, this is Gentle Fluidity Gold. This will not be my last Maison Francis Kirk Dijon fragrance because I love this house. And Sheree, if you are watching, girl, he owes you a check because I needed this after you spoke so highly of not only the house but also the fragrances and I must say that I'm very very pleased with this I may even I may even like this more dare I say than Baccarat Rouge I mean obviously because I have Baccarat Rouge but this made it to my current top five fragrances so I would really recommend this. This is something that it's it's gentle enough to wear it every day and that's why I've been wearing it again around my kids, around my family, around my house. But it's definitely not basic. It's it's something that's interesting that will definitely get you, I don't know if you guys are still wearing face masks, but here in New York we're still wearing face masks. So the only person who's been smelling me is my mother and my kids and let me tell you you all know how mothers are. If anyone's going to tell you the truth about something, it's going to be your mother. So um, this got her stamp of approval. And my mother is not the easiest to please, let me tell you. <laughs> so we had Flora Botanica, Delina Exclusive, Monger Lawn, Gentle Fluidity, and last but not least, this is Lalique Solil beautiful bottle with a beautiful fragrance y'all don't look at my nails please don't look at my nails don't even shh, don't even go there but um Lalique is a glass actually a glass manufacturer which hence this bottle was beautifully done like look at that look at that bottle but they also pulled off this beautiful fragrance it is a centrist Centrist. It is a centrist, a centrist ball of fun, but the the musky notes in the base, when this dries down on me, it still stays fruity, but it's sexy. To me, on my skin, after it dries down, it smells like rum punch. Like, it's delicious. I smell delicious. I can't wait for my husband to come home from deployment. My husband is Jamaican, and I think he will enjoy it. My mother has enjoyed it, so I think my husband will enjoy it as well. I've been enjoying it. It is not only a beautiful bottle to look at, it's also a beautiful fragrance to wear. It's starting to warm up here. In fact, I don't know if you can hear the, the outside uh, noises going on, kids laughing, screaming, laugh, yelling, what have you. This is the warmest day so far in New York, so people are outside, like, <laughs> and I'm so happy for it. We needed some type of just boost in our our um our day to day. And you know, I'm not gonna get all snappy and sad because that's not what we're here for. But I think we all in this uh, uh just all over the world can use a couple of days of sunshine and just chillaxing. Like that's the best part about spring and summer is just being able to walk outside whether it's on your porch or your backyard and enjoy the weather and your family and just things to do even though we cannot necessarily go different places just enjoy yourself and smell good while you're doing it <laughs> i hope you enjoyed my 
uh, picks for my top five and hopefully you will come back and I'm again this is my first fragrance related video but it's definitely not my last I create videos that basically show you everything that I love about being a woman a wife and a mother lifestyle videos travel videos kid friendly video kid friendly in the sense of what you as a parent can do with your kids uh, lunchbox videos even though I don't know if these kids are going back to school and will need lunch but you can make these things at home for your kids and they will remember them and that's what my channel is all about creating memorable moments in time for not only your family but for yourself value yourself your time and your experiences and that will make life that much more magical and loving and you'll just just enjoy yourself. All right, now I'm rambling, but I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.